Alrighty, gonna give you a little tutorial on how to uh, create a document, share a document, uh, insert an image into that document. So go to your documents on your Team Eureka account, then click on create and just choose a new document. First thing you want to do when you start a new document is change the title from untitled document. So just click on untitled document and let's call this test document. Say OK, and now your document has a title. Alright, so next thing we want to do is share this document so other people can edit and work on this at the same time. So we come over to the Share tab, click on Share, and add the people that we want to edit this document. So I'm going to add Heather to this document, and you can add multiple people just by continuing to type. You can choose what settings you want to allow them, whether they, they can edit the whole document or just make comments or just view it so you could change those things. You can also say whether you are or not going to send them an email. If you want to add an additional message to that you can just type in an additional message and it'll send it to them. If they're sitting right there with you and you don't want to send them an email just uncheck that box and it won't send them an email. They'll just show up in their document list. So once you do that you click Save and then it's say added them to the list. All right now what you want to do is uh, you're going to type some text and this is where you're going to write whatever you're going to write in your document and say you want to insert an image now there's two different ways to get to that menu you can either click on this insert image icon or you can come up here to the insert tab and then select image either one will work. Now there's a couple different ways to insert an image. You can upload one that's on your computer if you have one on there. You can go to a specific URL of an image if you know that, say from a Picasso web page or a Flickr page or anything like that. In fact one way to do that I'll show you. You can just come over here and do an image search uh, picture of a pig and it'll bring up some pictures of pigs. And if it doesn't bring images right off the bat, you can always change it from a web search to an image search, and that will bring up all your pig pictures. Once you find a picture that you want, like this cutie right here, I just click on it, and it takes me to the web page that that picture is located on, but it also shows me a little preview of the picture. When I'm here, I can just right click on that picture and copy the image URL that will allow me to go back to my document and just enter in the URL here and that picture should show up in a second or so and if it doesn't that means that's not a valid picture and it won't work so pick a different picture you could say select and it will insert that picture for you it takes just a second and there it is another way to insert a picture would be if I come down here and get make some more text and I want to insert an image I can go back to inserting an image and instead I can do a Google image search right within here it does limit the number of pictures so now if I say pig I'm gonna get different pictures but I could still choose one from here it's a bit easier I could say oh I wanted a cartoon one like that so highlight it say select that one and it will throw that picture in there as well any second now there it is once the picture is in your document it's easy to click on the little handlebars and resize it it does have some options do you want the text to wrap around it or do you want it to stay in a fixed position so that's how you create a document change the name of the document share it with other people and insert pictures hopefully that helps you get things done